Vet no balls, vet no balls. No, what are you talking about? Do you hate yourself? Call of Duty veteran is a terrible experience. I'm going regular, and I might even bump it down to easy later. We'll see. A coalition of allied commandos thrown together and aimed at where our enemy was most vulnerable. What are we? Some kind of COD Vanguard squad? We're starting off with a train sequence. Amazing. Train sequences are always the best levels in games they're in. Starting off strong. Here we go. Press B to crouch and approach an enemy silently. Okay. So press B. There we go. I don't care about your takedown animation. That's not true. I do like them. Let's see one right now. Eh, not that cool. Where's a cliffhanger mission? Like, this is fine, but where's a snowmobile? You know what I'm saying? If this is so important, why did they not send an army? It's really distracting having Laura Bailey just do a bad Russian accent. Not the best choice for voice actor, I don't think. Car 98K, that's my favorite gun from zombies. This gun costs 200 off the wall. Bang, I missed. Look, a secret German submarine. It's always a submarine. Maybe if they spent more time on land in the real world, they would have won the war. Out of the way, Nazis. I need this sub to go rob Mr. Rubio. The Panther statue's here. It's a special event. Look, it's a bad Hans Landa impression. Is one of his soldiers' job to carry the chair around at all times in case he has to monologue menacingly? Ow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I made fun of the chair. Double press while moving forward to activate tactical sprint. What the heck? Is it a sprint but you put your gun up and look dumb? You sprint like normal. I tactical sprint. We are not the same. We have a psychic in our army. He can operate the MG42 with his brain. Sorry, Germans. If there's a red flare, that means we win and you lose. That's just the rules of warfare. It is a little unfair, but I didn't write them. Oh, now we're back in 1945. Is that the Hobbit? Is that Hobbit man? It looks like him, doesn't it? Mary, don't say that. You're supposed to be one of the good guys. We've had one world war, yes. But what about second world war? Is he Hans Landa too? How many Hans Landas are in this game? Ah. I am Laura Vili's Russian grandfather. I hope I do not die to make her angry at the Nazis. You shall play a critical role in our war effort. Sit in the chair. I don't want to sit in the chair. I had a bad experience with the chair a few minutes ago. Can I not get around it? Nope, I have to sit in the chair. Okay, let's take a load off. Here we go. Let's sit down for tea in Call of Duty. There's gonna be three more CODs before their choose your own adventure FMV games. Yeah, really. Yay, finally they put Uncharted Climbing in Call of Duty. I thought it couldn't get any better after I drank tea, but now I can climb buildings as well. New objective, report to the medical corps. New objective, get killed by a tank. Ah, uh, sure is a great vista we have here in Stalingrad. Oh no! All right, we better get climbing. Ow. Did I die? Flee from the bomb more quickly. Hey, stop making fun of this scene. It's cool. It's dramatic, okay? The dad's gonna die and it's gonna be sad. Take it seriously. Our first year film students worked very hard on this script. First year film students. Oh, that explains why Hans Landa's in it. Dude, it's glass panels. It's just like Squid Game. Don't worry. I worked in a tempered glass factory my whole life. I can tell which COD campaigns are good. Ooh, good thing I survived getting shot a million times and a building falling on me. Oh no, one plank. Ugh. Could it be? I have a gun? Wow. I didn't know Call of Duty was a first-person shooter. Papa, where are you? Did you get killed in today? Oh, they had the gun. There we go. <gasps> Father, are you okay? Hang on, stay still. Take care of each other. Oh, no. You just doomed the brother to die. Why would you do that with your dying words? I better make it sad when the brother gets killed as well. <sighs> are you a bad guy? Yeah. Oh, he just, <laughs> he just turned around. That looked like an Arma 2 NPC. Six. Go prone. Over. Copy that. Going prone. Over. This is gonna give me motion sickness. Ugh. No wonder Assassin's Creed is third person. Don't do that again, please. Hey, shoot over here at me. You can't hit me, I bet. He's not even looking at where he's shooting. He's just blindly firing into the square. Hey, I'm over here. Oh, he's dead. Never start with a hand. The victim gets all woozy. See? Midway. Ooh, okay. Just remember we're a team up there. And stay in formation this time or the sag will have both your stripes. Yeah, formations just slow me down. You see what I <laughs> formations slow me down, yeah. I'm a solo act. Formations just slow me down. Out of my way, nerds. I'll blow you apart if I have to. Friendly fire will not be tolerated. <laughs> Come here. Take that. Uh-oh. Oh, I don't crash into him. This is crazy. There we go. Return to mission. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm trying. I can't turn very fast. Stop, I'm trying. I left the mission. You can't, if you go out of the bounds, you can't turn around fast enough to get back in. Climb and get in the clouds. Get your ass back here, Jack. What do you mean? You told me to climb. 
You told me to come up here. What are you talking about? What? New objective. Group up and gain altitude. That's what I did. That's what I did. I'm dead. Oh, no. You just, you just bounce off the ocean. <laughs> Moing. Numa Numa Trail. <laughs> my he my who focus oh no what x-ray vision stealth set why call of duty just be a gun game you don't gotta put every other game in call of duty just make it be guns i don't want to do the stealth let me finish this part come on call of duty let me play the next part please what the behind me that he just spawned him in they just spawned that guy in. Oh, my God. How far back am I? Oh, I'm back at the bunker. Oh, my God. This is so long. Did someone play test this and say, yeah, it's fun? Because that guy should be fired. Stealth sections like this are only fun if you have a silenced gun. If you don't have a silenced gun, they suck. Please don't torture us. Please don't do it. Oh, no. He's got a sword. I wanted to see the katana. That's lame. No torture scene this time, boys. Treyarch didn't make this one. There's a difference between suicide sacrifice you do well to learn it you better learn how to kill yourself <laughs> you better learn how to do a good suicide wade a good way to kill yourself is by trying to not do stealth in the stealth section i already learned oh the flamethrower looks pretty cool it looks nice is this the best looking flamethrower ever in a game it might be it looks really good tell me what your team is planning that's a good rendition to me usually propaganda posters like make the enemy look evil but that's just like a good photo stalingrad again we just were here Oh, the brother has to die. Aim right at him. Where'd he go? Where'd you go? Huh? There he is. Ah, you got in my way. Did I collateral them? Oh my god, I collateraled them. I collateraled that guy from like 300 meters away. Can I play the piano? Nah, it's broken. Will it make a piano sound when I shoot it? Come on. Don't get sniped, please. I told you not to get shot in the cutscene. No one follows my instructions in this game. I already did this with Soap in Modern Warfare 3 and he died anyway. Prepare to get out stealth. This is like when you're with Soap as well. Is this whole game just Modern Warfare 3? I guess not, because in Modern Warfare 3 during this part, if you shoot one time, you just get killed by a tank. This game is putting control back in the hands of the players. Hang on, there's the exact brick I have to climb. Defeat Steiner. Oh, he's just in this room somewhere. Okay. Steiner, where are you? Oh, there he is. Come here. Come here. What? Stop monologuing. It better not be three hits to kill him. Let's see. Okay, I got him. Is it gonna be three hits to kill him? Please, no. Don't do it. Oh, he disappeared. Yep, it's three hits to kill him. Here we go. Or it's one, two, three stabs. You're out in the cod van. Guard. Push him off the cliff. He's right there. Come on, push him off. Kick him. Give him a little kick. Give him a little kick. Shut up. Kick him off already. Kick him off the building, please. Pretty please, kick him off the building. Come on. No. Push him off the building. Thank you. No, a little more. A little more. Come on. Just a little bit more. You can do it. Thank you. Wait, I don't get to see him land. Show him landing. Show him landing. He better land right next to these guys. Come on, land. Yes. Red barrel. What? Red barrel. There we go. Too many shots. Red barrel should die in one shot. What do we do with him? Kill him. I can think of a few things. Kill him. Yeah, there you go. He lost the Hans Landa impersonation contest. Nice cans, Jerry. Get it? Because jerry cans, they blow up. Whoa, there you go. Why do the jerry cans blow up in one shot, but the barrels don't? Now they're doing Modern Warfare 3 again. Did they just play Modern Warfare 3 and say, let's copy that entire game? Ow, that, holy crap, that was really crunchy. That sounded like it hurt. Hang, hang on, guys, hang on. I, I can't, I broke all my legs jumping off of a balcony for no reason. Ugh, oh boy. Time to die, main bad guy of the game. Shoot him. Shoot him in the head. He wants to have another Hans Landa speech. Don't let him, just kill him. Letting him monologue again is like letting him win. Oh, baby. We're doing the gasoline. We're giving him the old Trevor GTA 5. Spoilers for a game that's like eight years old. Toss a cigarette on him. Give him the old General Shepard. Do the General Shepard. Good, that's one less loose end. Yes. Do not trust Laura Bailey. I repeat, do not trust Laura Bailey. COD Vanguard campaign review. It's whatever. On a scale of meh to fine, I give it a eh.
Couldn't have done it without you. Oh, you get an achievement for watching the credits. That's so nice. 